That's not a strike off, that's a hammer. He's going to pull you by your beard. First truck's empty. Did you clean your truck last night? Hey, nobody washed this yesterday. No, no, no. Put in like eight gallons. This is super stiff. That ain't coming out. Ah. Oh my goodness. Oh, easy money. Good morning. It is a little after five and I'm just getting ready to leave for work. Today we have a really busy day. We're pouring that entire big driveway. I'm a little bit nervous. There's rain moving in at four o'clock. So first pour, it's 25 yards, it's at seven. And then the rest is at 11. So the window that we have from 11 till five, that's enough to get the concrete finished. Um, but you're at a stage there where the concrete's still gonna be, you know, soft enough to get damaged from rain. So we might have to stick around and cover it. I don't know, we'll just see what happens. Either way, we're gonna be in a rush to get everything done. My mom's coming today, it should still be a fun day. All right, I'm gonna take this trash out. I will see you guys at the coffee shop. How much garbage do we make? Good work. Like five minutes before my starting time, I threw out, I threw out all my garbage and I dropped my keys in the garbage. Oh yes. no, I've done that. Oh. Like all right, thank you. All right, you have a good one. You too. See you next time. Yep. It's 5:43, just pulling into the yard. I need to grab the soft cut saw because we need to cut the garage floor that we poured yesterday, and I gotta grab my little Victory logo stamp. The guy watched the channel and he asked to have the stamp in his driveway. Grab my little stamps. I don't know which one he wants, the easy money or the victory logo. I'll bring them both, let him decide. Maybe he wants both. It's 5.51, Francisco just texted me he said he's going to be late. I'm going to start these trucks so they're warmed up and ready to go. Eric's here. And I think that's Big Ray. Eric and Big Ray. Sir. Are you around the corner? Yeah, I am around the corner. I'm on the hand to put in the uh, lane. All right. Yep. All right, sounds good. We'll see you soon. All right, thank you. All right. Bye. Concrete sorter. Morning, Bay Ray. Morning. Oh. Oh, my you ready? Yep. Yep. Oh, of course I'm ready. I was born ready. Good. My throat's not ready, but Francisco and Tino are on the way, right around the corner. So don't wait for Tino, just go ahead. Okay, we're out of here. It's a few minutes after six. Little Ray and Carlito are gonna meet us on the job. So we should have a full crew today, which is good, because we're gonna need everybody. All right, it's about 6.25. Just coming up to the job here. Still completely, completely pitch black. There's not even a hint of light yet. We gotta cut this garage floor. <sighs> can't see anything, can't find anything. Carlitos here. I hear him singing over there. You guys need to put some screed pins in the center yeah, yeah, yeah. for striking. And then, uh, Get the Bobcat, or New Holland, get the New Holland out of here. Get the forks out of here. Put that all on the road, out of the way. Go to there, and then dog it. I'll dog it to the chimney. So dark. I can't see nothing. I'm over here tripping all Francisco was parked right there. He was waiting for the kids and movies. He's like, come on, get out of the way. He wanted to park there? That's the bus stop. 
The kids ain't going. <laughs> the kids aren't going anywhere. Okay, garage floor is cut, 657. I got to mark joints. Where is my tape measure and marker that I had? Oh, I got it right in the front yard. Front yard? Make a big Y turn and try to get as straight as you can so we're not crushing the corners. Yep. Uh, I'll them up with you. Thank you. It's that time of year you gotta warm up your boots. Alright, concrete's here. And we are ready. Alright, here we go. 25 yards. Oh, uh, Daniel called me into his office again last night. What? Who told him about the gravel? <laughs> One of you guys texted him. <laughs> Francisco again? It has to be. It has to be. We're going to do like we did last time. You can, you stay back and bowl float. That worked pretty good last time. So we'll just do the same thing. How come we got three parlors? It feels like I'm the only one. Yeah, right. Come on, guys. The sticker needs to go. That's not good. We don't want that in there. That's better. Give it a couple gallons, please. Hurry up, Ray. We need a strike off. A shorter one, not that one. That's not a strike off, that's a hammer. Oh. Wait till Daniel sees you grab a hammer when I ask for a strike off. Wait. He's gonna pull you by your beard. Francisco's getting better. I mean, he's not as good as you, Eric, but there's only a couple people that are in the whole planet. First truck's empty. That plywood can go. All right. Not too bad so far. Going good so far. By yourself, Eric? Are you conquered with the hoss? No. Morning. Good morning, sir. How you doing? Good. Let's go. Good shot. Right? Nice. What's this? Man. Did you clean your truck last night? Tell me the truth. That's this from yesterday. <laughs> barrier wall? I have barrier wall, yes. Oh man. 
Look at how Tino puddles this for you. I didn't puddle yet. I just pushed it. Oh. You need help, Eric? Yeah. <laughs> Go! Look how hard that is. That's hard. That's why you're better on block over here. No! Oh my god, watch out. He's gonna bite the <laughs> Put in four gallons. Four. You're doing you're doing good right there. That's perfect, Francisco. Andale, andale. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Come on. Uh, we need to shut off here. Yeah, you working on it? You guys yeah, work on that? It, yeah. Put up a string. <laughs> Tino, you haven't showed up to come along practice for six weeks straight. Uh, yeah. And it shows. I know. I should go feel the concrete up there. It's probably poppity popping. I probably should. I had a dream that I put too much NCA in the concrete. Yeah? Yeah, today. Oh, you ordered the concrete? Yeah. Oh. I put way too much NCA. <laughs> what happened? I knew it. How did I put this much? I don't understand. Ooh, man, it's, it's ready for joints. It's Hey, it's setting up for real. I got to get the joints in. Oh yeah, it's going, going quick. It is going quick. Which is kind of good today, to be honest. As long as it doesn't go too crazy. I'm in here. Why are you scared? I'm gonna hit it. I'm gonna get it right in there. I used to be a pitcher in Little League. Me too. Yeah? yeah. I probably played against you and I smoked you. Yeah, oh, okay. Ready? It's a little low. A little low. There's a black mark on the edge. Oh, boy. No, no, no. Hey, whose dog is this? You don't see the Sharpie mark. Over there. I think I see it from here. That way. More. Okay, thank you. I can see it from here. <gasps> Throw it here. Here. <laughs> you used to be a pitcher. <laughs> if I can get these joints ripped in really, really soon, we'll be all right. Somebody left the gate open here. Oh, yeah. The dog kept running over. I was like, no, no, no. no. Nobody washed his broom yesterday. Look at the broom. Whoever broomed the sidewalk didn't wash a broom or put it somewhere it got put away. That's no good. Alright, the second load is wet. We're fine. 
second lower we're in good shape this is kind of the blend right here half and half flip all the plywood out of the way take the skid steer regrade and re and then recompact too all the way down to the blocking by the road snap it by you a little bit okay next orange line that's good Tino, catch this edge right here. You're gonna go, these two guys are gonna go this way. Okay. Because that's two hard squares. Yep. We're just gonna go this way because there's only three squares that are ready. The middle of the driveway is wet. Hey, nobody washed this yesterday. It's full of concrete. That's your excuse. What's up, Daniel? Take a picture, send it to him. Oh, don't do that, right? Take a picture. Alright, I'm sending it to him right now. Hey, you wanna smile? You won't be smiling later. When you're looking for your three teeth that are on the floor. Eric, I might need you to stand on the joiner. Look at this. Whenever you guys get like halfway through the next square, you three guys are gonna have to broom that first one yourselves. Cause I'll never be able to reach from the outside, it's way too far. Hey Tino, if you're getting ahead of them, take a hammer and go pound out that broom. You know what I'm talking about? Yep. Pound the bristles. Yes. Cause that thing is crusted over bad. Okay, making progress. Okay, everything's going good. All the joints are in. Straight. Really small squares like usual. So right now it is 9.30. We started at seven. Conquer is here at seven. I got one more joint to cut. The short one there, I gotta go around through the garage. Carlitos got this all graded, recompacted. We're gonna put the plywood back, put some mesh in, and we're, we're pretty much ready to pour again. There was no damage done to the edge of the asphalt at all by the road. So that's good. Yeah, everything's going really good. My mom's going to be here about 10.30 with a big pot of chili. I'm looking forward to that. It's a chili kind of day. I love chili, especially when it's got some kick to it. I had three quarters percent NCA, which seemed about perfect. I told Eric we had two percent. He still thinks there's two percent here, but... There's not, it's just three quarters. Hello. That's a really nice looking dog. I don't even know what these dogs are doing here. What are you guys doing, huh? Where's your house? Where's your home? Show me where you live. No. Oh. How do we have three big dogs on today's job? Just running doing? wild. You gotta excuse my voice, it's just about gone again today. I'm just not getting over this very quickly at all. These leaves are starting to come down. That's going to be a pain.
Okay, I need 18 and a half yards. Going to the same place I was this morning, same concrete, same everything. Grandma's here. I gotta hurry up and get this driveway finished. I don't care what it looks like, Grandma's here. No, I don't even care if you pay me or not at this point. <laughs> really? <laughs> Hi, Mom. How they expect people to do. How are you? Hi, Ryan. I run I a big old pot of chili, so if it's working out good. Oh, yep, I just gotta finish brooming, but these guys can start eating now because we got concrete on the way. <laughs> Pumpkin spice. <laughs> All right. I need a sip of that now. My throat's really raw again. Yeah. You gotta drink medicine now. Mm -hmm. Whoa, that's heavy on the pumpkin spice, Mom. It tastes like pumpkin pie. Hey, Eric, you're looking at that chili like it's only enough for you. There's a whole pot here. Steaming hot chili. Do you know how hard pulling wire is? <laughs> what did you just say? He said pulling wire is the hardest job. Wow! Hey, it's mine. It's mine. Hustle. <laughs> you do got to focus. Yeah. Because I always catch you not pulling the wire even with the hook in your hand. <laughs> nice straight joints. I got one ball spot right there with the broom. Gotta get that. Seven more squares of broom. And I should have about 15 minutes to eat chili. All right, Ma, here's your chance. You ready? Okay, okay here we go. Easy money. All right, that first pour went really good. Really, really nice. And we are all ready for the second pour. Grandma's here. We're going to eat some lunch real quick. 10.35, concrete's in 25 minutes. So that timing worked out great. Rain's at four. So if it actually holds off till four, we got five hours, which will be enough, I think, for it to set. Got a little breeze starting, that'll help dry the surface. You tell the truth, you want to no get... coke for you today? That's why he's so salty today. Nah, no wonder. Yeah, man. No I coke. My thing is all water. <laughs> <laughs> you were crying no, so you bad. You were crying so bad. You should have put what you said. Well, you were you kind of crying, crying too. You were way more. Yeah, yeah. Well, when I left, when you left, he was like, no. Yeah, he's like, Oh, the fly spray. I use that whole bottle. <laughs> Some bad memories right there. They're funny memories, though. I'm going to Concrete's here. We're going to have some leaves, unfortunately. Just just park back there for now. I got to get my mom out of here. That's her car. Okay. Thank you, bye! Now this guy's got a junky truck, man. $100, this thing don't fit. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, you got a sledgehammer? We're gonna need it. Remember when he started? Let me spray. Put it four gallons. You ate too much? Oh, he ate too much. Oh, him too? All he has to do is pull a wire. You could do that when you're in a coma. I don't want no splashing. Be really careful on the edge. Ray's telling us to add water, and all he does is pull the wire. It shouldn't matter to you. Whoa! Dude, that would have took my whole all my teeth out. Why would you go that close to my teeth? He's just salty because I'm not taking him to Key Largo. Already here? Ah. You sure the water's going in your load? Because it hasn't changed it at all. I don't think the water's going in this load. That's good, I guess. No, it doesn't. Put a couple more gallons in now. Ah! 
shut it off for another two. Uh, Ray, grab the blower. Grab the leaf blower. There's some leaves out there. Shouldn't be the contractor's responsibility to do this. Okay, we're ready. Yeah, like leave it a little high when you pour. Okay. Really high on his side. Thank you. Really high over there. Put in, put in like eight gallons. That's super stiff. It's really stiff. Like it's cracking. That ain't coming out. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Are you trying to scrape the chute with the wire puller? Come on, Ray. He was trying to scrape it with the wire puller. Hey, do that again. Do that again. No. Yeah, do it again. We'll send that to Daniel. It's making me tired and we're not even accomplishing anything. Look at this. It's standing straight up. Get the hammer again. Pick that up. Okay, down, down. Shut it off. Put five more gallons in. It's still cracking. Yeah, it's better now. Uh, it's it's not that wet. It just looks wet right on the top. It's ready for joints already. Ay, 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 ay. Hey, shut it off. It's a mile high. No, we don't. Put two gallons in. Definitely ready for joints. There's no marks, I'll just tell you where to go. That way. This way. This way. How come I point this way and you go that way? Not mad about that because there is rain coming at four. So yeah, we're having a hustle now, but I'll be able to relax when the concrete's hard at four o'clock. And the rain comes. I'll tell you how we are in a second here. We're all right. We're gonna have to hustle, but we're all right. We're good. Hey, Ray's actually pretty good at that, Eric. We don't have time to play. The concrete's getting hard on the top. Thank you. Snap your side. Yeah, it's ready, ready. 
it's, it's not even edge here yet so that's going to be priority guys are on it leaves are blowing everywhere it's no fun no fun guys are on struggling struggling two things got us the driver bringing it like at a one inch slump and the leaves are killing us i mean look at this oh yeah yeah Come on. Let me see it. All you can do is your best, you know. There's gonna be some leaves in the surface. That's just the way that it is. It's all you can do is your best. It drives me nuts, but you know, what are you gonna do? Yeah. Yeah, you're better off passing it to them at this point. Here and there, just let them get right behind them. Yeah. Oh my goodness! So if you want to go in there and have her scrape it, I don't want my new machine all splashed with concrete. Yeah. I don't want it. So you want me to lift the dough bucket then? No, go in there and then you can lift the bucket and then put it right here. So the concrete goes right yeah, in there and doesn't splash all over. Got it. Let me go walk. You got to come down, man. Dude, these leaves. Oh! Ray, we got something going on right here. I think those are leaves or something. Sorry. It looks really bad though. I was going to tell you to reach up there and then I saw your arms. I was like, nah, <laughs> never mind. I don't think we're going to have to worry about rain at four. I think it's going to be just fine. It's only one o'clock. It feels like 3.30. Doesn't it feel like 3.30? It's only one. And we're all tired, ready for a nap. This was easy though. Easy money. Imagine bugs today. He would have been so angry. He would have been right francisco he would have been yelling like crazy today when we were down here pouring when it was real stiff oh man and tino left it super high <laughs> uh can you fix this a little bit carlito it looks really bad it looks like swiss cheese you know what i mean coming back to every time every second Maybe next year I'm just gonna come and work for you and shut Victory down. I'll work for Easy E Concrete. You can make a video and say you hired a new guy. I show up with a wig. That would be really funny. That'd be really funny. And some big Coke bottle glasses. We still conquered it like it was nothing. And the joints look good. The joints look really nice. Look at that. It looks good. 
a nice looking driveway. You like it, Tino? Yes. Easy money. Yes, sir. Very easy. It was God. a headache, but easy. <laughs> it was kind of a headache, honestly. But I'm really happy with it. I'm glad that's over. I did tell the guys that I said if we finish this driveway by the end of the day Wednesday, they could have Friday off paid. I'm saying like we should get paid like the football players. Oh, oh yeah, like, like a thousand dollars a yard. It's 44 yards. That's a lot of money. 44, so? 44k. Don't you think so? For each of you. Oh yeah. For every every construction. Okay, driveway is done and it looks really nice. That second pour was, it was a struggle. I ain't gonna lie. With the lady that came and then all the leaves, but we got it. It looks super good. Super good. So it looks on the radar like it's gonna rain in about an hour and a half. Concrete will be brick hard by then. I ain't even worried about it. And it looks like light rain. It's not gonna be like a thunderstorm or whatever. It's just light green on the radar, but it is coming. This is what the concrete truck driver left us on the street. More work for us. Ouch. Francisco, there's a bunch of gravel under your truck. There's a bunch of gravel on the street under your truck. We're going to have to move your truck and sweep it all. Wow. Tell them to move back to put this on here. Not acceptable. We need something to put this in. You gotta get the street clean, dude. In time. You leave it like this, neighbors will be calling right away. Just grab a grab a ham room. Amazon guy just came here. He walked right over the caution tape. Put his foot right there in the concrete. I was screaming at him. Otherwise, he would have walked right up. Right? Yeah, that's right. How brain dead do you got to be to walk over the caution tape like that? I was I was screaming though. I stopped him. He only took one step. If we would have left 10 minutes ago, you would have you would have fresh prints all the way up your driveway. That would have stressed me out. The guy would have called me right away and said, hey, the Amazon guy just walked all the way up the driveway. Can you imagine that? Yeah, it happened to me, right, right, remember? We're literally leaving yeah. in five minutes. The first job I went on, Eric. First step, um, and she stepped on a car. She stepped on it. I was glad I didn't stamp it before. I don't know where they find the Amazon drivers. Saw that? Did they let him smoke weed on duty? They must. I didn't catch it on camera. I wish I would have because I was, I screamed. I was like, stop. And he looked at me with big eyes like, what? <laughs> Tino, Tino tied little flags on it. <laughs> we got to shove all this into the power buggy. All this and this. And then the wood's got to go on the back of the truck. Tino, get a shovel. I'm gonna send Eric and somebody else here tomorrow. I don't know if I put that on video or not, but they're gonna pressure wash the garage, get all the splatter off the brick, make sure everything is 100%, have them rake all the edges, finish cleaning. It's supposed to rain tomorrow. It's a good day for it. You gotta wash this approach tomorrow too. Pressure wash everything like perfect. Rake all the edges in, there's a bunch of roots still up there. On the grass, off the edge, get everything like a hundred thousand percent. Uh, the ramps are up. The machine's not tied down. I know that. Okay. I'm gonna get it going. Start going like. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna get it going. Oh, there's something. Yeah, remember that time in the morning, the Monday morning, when you told me you supposed you ain't tied down? I was gonna move up and then tie it down. That was my plan. You can't make an excuse a week later, <laughs> right? That was last week. I kept week. thinking about it. He thought about it. He thought about it. 
That was this week's money, and when he dragged it. You gotta think of an excuse right it. away. Yeah, we'll put that anyway. Right away. We'll put that we gotta make color on that patio too, on the lake. We never colored that yet. But tomorrow it's not rainy, right? On and off. All right, adios. Six thirty. Why are you so rough in my truck, man? He broke it, dude. Let me give it the touch. Pow! One shot. My 7.3, it loves me. It loves me. It doesn't like you. That was really lucky. I'm not sure why it started when I touched it. Anyways, all right, I'll see you guys in the morning. Adios.